We're at TV Hello. Line's Comic Con suite presented by ZTE with the cast of Bates Motel. Hi guys, how are you? Hi. Hi. Michael. I am Who's not gone? ready for this to be over. Where uh, either? I'm but... not ready for it to be over. I'm not I ready know. for Norma to be gone. And I was thinking about what it was that makes me sad about the fact that Norma is dead, even though Vera, you're still part of the show. And it's mm. that Norma in in um, Norman's eyes is very zen and sort of very mm. serene. Mm. But the Norma <laughs> that I love is like a spitfire and and you know oh. unpredictable and all that. Are we gonna see more of that in the oh, yes. new Norma? Yes. She's she's super dimensional, multifaceted. Okay. Uh, really interesting, really surprising. But that's a shift, though, because the Norma that we've seen in Norman's head has been very sort of like. Well, we've seen very little bits of her. Right. Like we're gonna get to spend more time with her now. Okay. And know her better. <laughs> know her more intimately. <laughs> and we, oh. we we started to get it. Now I started getting to know her, but those scenes never ended up in final edits. Oh. So so we have begun to explore mother. Yeah. And there have been some pretty racy things that we have shot. Yeah. That ultimately never made the final cut. Like what? <laughs> Kissing stuff. Yeah, there was one there was, really intense. There was a really cool scene. Yes. Yeah, even more than the things that the, the scenes that you already that you've already seen. For example, I think it was at the end of second, right, in the woods, or or there there've mm. been moments, but there mm. there was a really intimate moment that never ended up making. But the cool thing about that the scene power, that I really love the loved power it, balance it, between the two of yes, them and who's taking control. control and, yeah, yeah. And Vera, are you excited to <laughs> to? I guess both of you, are you excited for this final season? Because it's so different in so many ways now that everything's changed. Oh, yeah, man, it is, it is, but I'm feeling it. It is the mm -hmm. end of an era. It's not the end yet, but I, 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 I can see it, you know, where you can, you get a second wind. When you can see the finish line, there is yeah. a second wind, and we are excited. We're, we're, we're girded with, with that second wind, but it, I'm, I'm, I'm still bereft. I'm sad. I'm still Born mourning. In your own mm -hmm. passing. So uh, you know, and Carrie, there's obviously going to be a lot, lot of psycho callbacks in this final season. The big one, the shower scene. I'm curious, how are you going to approach that? Um, is it going to be a straight up homage? Is it going to be you're going to make it your own? Uh, well, nothing we're going to do with psycho is a straight up homage, except I'm fascinated to recreate that last psychiatrist. <laughs> <laughs> psycho, which is the only really not good part of Psycho. Mm -hmm. um, I just that character fascinates me. Um, but no, everything we're gonna do is uh, kind of driving through Psycho, but with with the world. I think you and Carlton should be the psychiat should replay the psychiatrist scene. You should just sit down and explain all the motivations behind everyone's actions on Bates Motel <laughs> in a really obvious way. So when he walks in here, he's feeling this because... But, it, it, yes, but it, it's the fun thing about Psycho is because it is so iconic, because so many people love it, and as do we, you know, it's fun to... It's fun to play with the mythology, you know, and that's what we're doing a lot this mm -hmm. year, but also, like, the challenges um, fitting it into our world in a way that's, that's fun and meaningful. How do you think Dylan's gonna to react to finding out his mom's dead? Um, <laughs> I think horribly. I mean, I think it's it's like something that I've been really curious um, to find out and to read um, as me, as me mm -hmm. um, since you know the end of last season. So mm -hmm. honestly, I don't I don't know how he's gonna take it, but I, I assume he's not gonna take it well. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> Celebration. And I think also just because they left off on such a sort of um, yeah. Without like really any closure, you know, and so I think mm -hmm. it's uh, I think it's going to be awful. And Nestor, are you going to have some help bringing down Norman? Maybe Marion Crane's sister is going to come in and help yeah. you. Yeah. Uh, who did you have your cast? Is he going to have yet? some help? <laughs> 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 well, <laughs> he's got a lot. You got a lot to go through. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah there, I mean, the this last season is is interesting because everyone spiraled out at the end of this season. A lot of characters, you know, it was like this tornado and, and, and sort of everyone kind of went out on their own path. And I think the last season brings everybody, it sort of draws them back in uh, in different ways. Uh, and it's, it's gonna be really fun.